Hi everybody, it's me, Norma Buchholz, the executive chef here at Brooks Winery. And today we're gonna to be making the perfect pairing for April, which is a steak tartare with some crispy potato chips and some salted crostini on the side. The wine that we're gonna be serving with our steak tartare today is our Seventillion Toluca Lane Pinot Noir. To start, I have some cleaned beef tenderloin here. Um, this is prime choice, um, but all you actually need are two four to five ounce pieces. So to start, you wanna just cut the meat into about one inch cubes. So I will cut them into strips first like this. And then from here, you're just going to start mincing it up. Okay. So the next thing we are going to do is just add um, the ingredients and we're gonna get them mixed together and then we're going to incorporate them with the beef. For that, it is going to be Dijon mustard. minced shallot, some minced Italian flat leaf parsley. I have some capers here and these are the smallest ones. Um, if you get the bigger ones, they need to actually be chopped, but these I have rinsed and dried. Then I have some minced anchovies. And for a little bit of spice, I'm choosing to add some ground horseradish. If you don't have horseradish, use hot sauce. If you don't like spice at all, you can totally just skip this step. I'm gonna add a couple dashes of Worcestershire. Crack these in here. only want the yolk. So then if you just take your hands and kind of use them as a strainer, the whites will very easily just remove themselves. We're gonna add both of these inside. I also like to add the zest of a lemon. So just grab your microplane. And then we're gonna take all of this give it a little bit of a mix, and we're just gonna drizzle in some extra virgin olive oil. And last but not least, just a pinch of salt and black pepper. And now we're gonna mix it with our beef. So we'll just take all of this, just incorporate it. All right, so we're gonna let this sit in the refrigerator for a couple minutes and we're gonna fry our chips that are gonna go on top. So for this, we have fingerling potatoes and I've just put these through the mandolin super thin. So you're just gonna wanna take, I like to do about a fourth of a cup. So we're gonna make two here. So get close to about a half a cup. And this oil is at 300 degrees and we are gonna fry two to three minutes. So to plate this dish, you can either just free hand it and just pour the tartare onto a mound. If you have a ring, you wanna do a little bit of presentation, use one of these. And just set that in the middle there. We're gonna take our beef mixture and we're just going to place it right down in the bottom of the mold. Carefully remove this. And then we will take some of these chips and we are just going to put them right on top. 
Then for the side as well, I've just made some salt roasted crostini. You cook these in an oven for about 15 minutes, rotate the pan halfway through, a little bit of olive oil, salt, lay them flat on the pan, and you wanna do them just about this thick. And that is the perfect pairing for April. Now we need to try it. perfect. I would highly recommend coming up and trying this for yourself. Cheers. Thank you so much for joining me today. And that's a wrap, everybody. <laughs> Get a kink in my neck, I swear. 